There's a lake in Africa where life ends in silence, a place where animals that touch the water do not simply die, they turn to stone. So this is Lake Natron, a red shimmering lake in northern Tanzania, beautiful from a distance and deadly up close. The water here is unlike anything else on earth. It isn't just salty, it isn't just hot, it's a chemical trap a mixture of volcanic minerals with a pH as caustic as ammonia and temperatures that can reach 60 degrees Celsius. If a bird, bat, or small animal lands on the lake, the water burns their skin. The minerals seep into their body, and over time, the creature becomes preserved in a shell of hardened salt and ash, a natural mummification, a statue carved by chemistry. Early explorers believed the lake had supernatural powers, that it froze life in place, trapping animals in the moment of their death. But the truth is darker and more fascinating. The minerals in the water replace the moisture in the flesh. Bones, feathers, and skin become coated in crystallized salt. The animal keeps its shape as if frozen in fear. And here is the strangest part. The lake isn't empty. Flamingos thrive here. They feed on the algae that blooms in the toxic water and build nests on its solid, salty shore. Life and death, side by side. A perfect contradiction. Lake Natron is a reminder that the world still holds places that feel supernatural, otherworldly, almost impossible. A lake that kills with chemistry a lake that preserves its victims as statues, a lake that turns the living into stone.